Hi Mike here from Super and Gadgets and welcome to a brand new video with my latest acquisition. This here is a vertical video mount so I can film straight down onto this rather scruffy table at the moment but in actual fact I'm going to pop some um, pop a sheet on there for it to look a little bit prettier. Um, and here we are, this is where I'm going to be doing some of my filming from now on. So, let's get started. So here we are, and what we're going to be doing is just showing today the workings of the Apple Pencil and getting shot just there. So this is the Apple Pencil. I've had it for just over a month, maybe a month and a half now. And if I can get it in shot. Um, so I'm going to be giving a quick demonstration of how I find it. Okay, so let's get started. So first of all, we're in Procreate. And what I'm going to do is do a little bit of tracing. I'm not too good at uh, painting and such like, really, to be honest. I'm not a very arty person at the moment. So what I'll do is I'll import an image. And I've got a fair few images here. I'm just going to my profile pictures and bring up a, a nice picture of Isaac. As you can see, my, uh, my cat, Isaac. So what I'll do is you go into bushes and you can pick all kinds of different effects of bushes so you've got your, your sketching your inking painting artistic airbrushing uh, and texture pens as well so what i want to do is go on to doing some inking i want to pick a gel pen and what i will do before i do anything is create a new layer to begin with just above the uh, the pit photo layer and to do the tracing I'll go in and turn down the um, layer opacity okay so what that does is it makes the uh, the picture in the background look fainter so you can easily trace it hop back onto the main layer which oops which I'm going to be uh, drawing on and then I can actually start drawing so what I'm going to do is just very simply if I can get my palm to stop being recognised, is simply trace round Isaac's head, such as that. And as you can see, I'm not too great at doing these uh, drawings, but the pencil works extremely well to get the, the lines in. And this is actually a gel pen, so it's not working off pressure as such. So what I'll do in a minute is actually do a little bit of pressure. Oops, you can undo by pressing on Procreate anyway, by pressing your two fingers on the screen, which makes it a lot easier than having to reach up somewhere and press and undo. That isn't brilliant at all, to be honest. I'll just undo that bit. I think I'll focus on doing this. Oops. So not too great at drawing at the moment, and that is something that yeah, is not no fault of the Apple Pencil, just me. Uh, what I'll do is I'll go into something maybe a little bit better so you can actually see the pressure sensitivity. So hopefully. <laughs> it's not working very well though. For some reason, why? What I'll do is I'll reset the bush actually. Oh. Back to its original default settings, and as you can see, the more you press on, the thicker the line. So I'll just undo that. So very, very faintly go round his eye. And then put a bit of thickness in there just to give him his pupil. And then do the same with this eye here. Very, very gently press a little bit harder in the uh, on his pupil just to bring that up. And then we'll just <coughs> we'll do it. We'll just shade that bit in there. This corner of his eye. And then we'll do the same with his nose. Oh, 
And as you can see, the, the pressure sensitivity is certainly coming out. I'm not doing it brilliantly, but it just gives you a demonstration of the Apple Pencil's abilities. What I'll do here is just do a bit more pressure and just do a bit of drawing here to just bring out his tones here and then do some whiskers bring out some whiskers and maybe just bring out his ears a little bit here and here a few bits of lines there and then give him a few freckles as well such as that and then what we've actually got is this bit of his body here now I could draw this so I will do just for show now as you can see it's actually lying on a chair here so I'll just do the the outline of the chair here and then bring in his paws as I said this isn't going to look very good at all to be honest because I'm not a great painter it's just giving you an idea of the Apple Pencil let's see a few lines there See that? Got a few tufts of hair coming out on this side and out of his ears this side. You can see just quickly doing it, you can see quite easily that it's it's the pressure sensitivity. We've got a few frettles here, which I've missed. And that is about it really. We can just do a bit of a shading there just to show his body. Because his body's kind of going into the chair because he's lay on the chair. So that is it. So if we just do that, as you can see, it's not brilliant by any stretch of imagination. Um it is coming along. If I just make sure I'm not actually on the um, on that one and I can quickly maybe bring in his paw here and you can keep doing that as you can see just to give him a bit more of a, some whiskers as well there And what we will do is just colour these in a little bit as well, his ears, just to give his ears a little bit of shading, just there. And give him another whisker there, I missed that one. Maybe a little bit of darkness round there, because that's what he did have. There, and a few spots just to bring out his darker areas. By no means perfect, but it does give you an idea of what the Apple Pencil is like. And if I go into another um, preset, you can see straight away if I draw and push down, you can actually see the uh, 
the pressure sensitivity working quite a bit there. And also, as you can see, you put it onto its side and again, you've got more of a pressure sensitivity and the side as well, so you can uh, you can get more of a more of a surface area when you do such things like that. As you can see, a few I've done here. I've done a sketch of uh, a dolphin, which I did on the with the Apple Pencil. One of Homer Simpson, <laughs> and one of a horse, which is actually um, I think that is my mum's horse. I did the picture, and if I can just bring up, if we've got the, we haven't actually got, no, that's actually, that's actually a painting I did through some uh, tutorial. A picture of our own horse that we've got in the family, Zelda, is here. As you can see, we'll bring up the original picture, there is Zelda, there is Misty, and as you can see, if I take a photo out in the background, I've uh, drawn Zelda there. And we also should have one of um, of Isaac. Here we go. Got one of Isaac here, which I did not so long ago. There's his original picture and, uh, and the, pay, uh, the sketch I did afterwards. That was on the 10th of January I did that. Uh, one of when he was a kitten can see and then uh, one I kind of made earlier of uh, the one I've just shown you just there which is a little bit better I suppose than I've done now so there you have that is the Apple Pencil and if I can just bring it into shot again as you can see that is the Apple uh, Apple Pencil and how it works. So I hope you've enjoyed this video. I'll see you all again next time. Thanks very much for watching. Goodbye.